when the Apostle Paul wrote his letter to the Romans, he says this to those Christians that want to follow after Jesus. But now having been set free from sin and having become slaves of God, you have your fruit to holiness and the end everlasting life. For the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life in Jesus Christ our Lord. Anyone wanting to follow Jesus has to get sin out of their life. That can only happen by you choosing to repent and call on the name of Jesus Christ. Many Christians are under the false impression that they don't have to do anything. They don't have to lift a finger. They say that Jesus has already done everything for them on the cross. Now they can kick back and watch TV. If you are not willing to get the things out of your life that are a hindrance, you won't be able to follow Jesus. Many Christians are addicted to their TV, to the movies, to worldliness. They just want to be entertained, but they could care less to hear from Jesus and go with him. If you are still sinning, you're a slave of sin. But if you really are following Jesus, you are a new slave to righteousness. Are you really going with Jesus? Are you his slave? Or are you still a slave to sin? May the grace of Jesus be with you.